Endangered Species, by me, Beth Gregory. Our world, it has its problems, but one I find to be of most interest is endangered species. Individual species are not the only factors involved in the dilemma. It's a broad issue, one that involves habitats and environments where animals of all kinds live and interact with one another. Most causes for endangerment are habitat destruction, mostly caused by humans, overpopulation, and other factors like disease. In the United States, 735 species of plants and 496 species of animals are listed as threatened or endangered. 266 of these listed have recovery plans currently under development. There are more than a thousand animal species endangered worldwide. Today, over 3,500 protected areas are in existence worldwide. Areas include parks, wildlife refuges, and other reserves. In addition, over 10 protection laws have been passed to protect animals and their habitats. If you're thinking about helping endangered species and other threatened wildlife, here are some tips to help you out. Tip one, protect habitats permanently in national parks, nature reserves, and wilderness areas. Two, when you visit national parks, talk to rangers and ask what is being done about threatened species. And also, when you go there, try to follow wildlife codes, such as fire regulations, and leave anything you find alone. And finally, you could even join groups to help animals. Remember people, if you love animals like I do, don't sit back and let them suffer. They won't be around forever.